एक्सरसाइज 1.3 क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री हियर इन क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री मेन हेडिंग वी हैव टेन सब क्वेश्चन बट इन दिस स्लाइड वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस ओनली फाइव क्वेश्चन टूडे सो लेट एस गो फॉर वन फर्स्ट सब क्वेश्चन सो एंड ऑब्जर्व फॉर ईच एंड एवरी मेन हेडिंग देर इज स्लाइड डिफरेंस इन फर्स्ट फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन दे गेव कॉमन डिफरेंस ये एंड वी यूज एस एन फॉर्मूला एन बाई टू टू ए प्लस एन माइनस वन इन टू डी एंड वी डिड सम बट इन सेकेंड क्वेश्चन दे गेव ए एंड ए एन एंड यूजिंग दट यूजिंग एंथ फॉर्मूला वी गॉट एन वैल्यू एंड यूजिंग दट एन वैल्यू वी सॉल्ट एस एन फॉर्मूला एस एन वैल्यू सो नाउ ह्योर ऑब्जर्व दे गेव सम हिंट यूजिंग दट हिंट वी हैव टू सॉल्व सो फर्स्ट ये गेव गिवन ए इक्वल्स फाइव डी इक्वल्स थ्री ए एन इक्वल्स फिफ्टी फाइंड एन एंड एस एन दे ओनली गिव ह्योर ए डी ए एन इज गिवन वी हैव टू फाइंड एन एंड एस एन सो लेट एस फाइंड एज यू नो हाउ टू फाइंड एन यूजिंग एंथ फॉर्मूला ए एन इक्वल्स ए प्लस एन माइनस वन इन टू डी ए एन इज फिफ्टी लेट एस सब्सटीट्यूट ए इज फाइव एन माइनस वन डी इज थ्री here directly they gave a value d value a n value just we have to find the given here n and s n so n nth formula substituting now take 5 to the lhs so it became minus 5 50 minus 5 it is 45 3 remains same so 45 n minus 1 3 so if we take this to the lhs it is divided 45 by 3 equals n minus 1 45 divided by 3 is 15 look here 45 divided by 3 is 3 ones are One remain, so five, fifteen. So fifteen n minus fifteen is equal to n minus one. If we take minus one to the LHS, it became plus one. So n equals fifteen plus one. N value is sixteen. So we got n equals sixteen. Using the sixteen, we have to find the S n or S sixteen. So what is S n formula? Why we took a n? So a n is given. So directly we went for this formula. N by two a plus a n. So n by two it is sixteen by two five plus fifteen. So five plus fifty is fifty five. Sixteen by two is eight. So fifty five into eight. So eight five is a forty. Eight five is a forty. Forty four. So our S N value is four forty. Clear. So here in this third main heading, they will they will give a value, d value, a n value. we have to find yes and yes and sometimes we have to find a n and d like this clear so second sub question given a equals 7 a value is given a 13 observe a 13 is given we have to find d and s yes 13 observe here a 13 yes 13 that means instead of a n Yes, n. Here, n is common. Here, both thirteen. That means by using this, n value is thirteen. We got the n value. Clear. Don't think that n is not given here. So here, a thirteen. Yes, thirteen. So n is equal to thirteen here. Value n of n value is thirteen. So let us take a n formula because a n is given. Let me take a n equals a plus n minus one into d. So that means here we have to take a thirteen. Or instead of writing this, you can directly write it as a thirteen equals a plus twelve d also a plus twelve d directly you can do it. So instead of that, I took a n formula a plus n minus one into d a n is nothing but a thirteen is nothing but thirty five a is seven n minus one thirteen minus one d we don't know. So to find d, we took this formula. Clear. So now. Take seven to the LHS, so minus seven, thirty-five minus seven equals twelve D. Thirteen minus one, it is twelve D. So thirty-five minus seven, it is twenty-eight. So twelve D. So if you take this to the LHS, it is division twenty-eight by twelve, twenty-eight by twelve. So if we divide by by this one, twelve Z. So four three Z, four seven Z. So seven by Three. So the simplest form is seven by three. So let us take this seven by three. So d value is seven by three. Now let us find the s thirteen. So s thirteen n by two a plus a n because we have this a n a thirteen they gave. So s thirteen is equal to thirteen by two. Thirteen by two seven plus 
थर्टी फाइव सेवन प्लस थर्टी फाइव सेवन इज ए थर्टी फाइव एन इज थर्टीन ए थर्टीन इट्स दे हैव गिवन थर्टी फाइव सेवन प्लस थर्टी फाइव इट इज फोर्टी टू सो इट इज लाइक दिस थर्टीन बाई टू इन टू फोर्टी टू सो टू वन जा टू ट्वेंटी वन जा सो थर्टीन इंटू ट्वेंटी वन थर्टीन इंटू सो इफ यू टेक ट्वेंटी वन इंटू थर्टीन थर्टीन वन जा थर्टीन थर्टीन टू जा ट्वेंटी सिक्स वन ट्वेंटी सेवन सो आवर आंसर इज टू हंड्रेड एंड सेवेंटी थ्री सो हियर डी वैल्यू इज सेवन बाई थ्री कैन गेट डेसीमल्स ऑल्सो डी वैल्यू एंड एस थर्टीन इज टू सेवेंटी थ्री थर्ड सब क्वेश्चन गीवन ए ट्वेल्व इज इक्वल टू थर्टी सेवन डी इक्वल्स थर्टीन फाइंड ए एंड एस ट्वेल्व लुक हियर इन प्रीवियस दे गेव ए वैल्यू ए थर्टीन दे गेव क्लियर सो दे टोल्ड अस टू फाइंड डी एंड एस थर्टीन बट इन दिस केस दे गेव ए ट्वेल्व D value we have to find A and S twelve. Just this is the difference. Instead of A, they gave D value. Here instead of D, they gave A value. So observe here A twelve, S twelve. So here our n value is twelve, twelve. So now let us take A n formula. A n equals A plus n minus one into D. A n is thirty seven. A plus n minus one here twelve minus one into three. So thirty-seven keep a as it is because we don't know the a value. Eleven three is a thirty-three. So here twelve minus one is eleven. Eleven three is a thirty-three. So a plus thirty-three. So plus thirty-three. If we go to the LHS, it became minus thirty-three. So thirty-seven minus thirty-three, we got a value four. Now they asked find s twelve. S twelve. So formula s n equals n by two a plus n because they gave n value. So let me substitute directly. S twelve. 12 by 2. So here the n value is 12 by 2. A value we got 4 here. So substituting that only 4 plus a n is 37. So 4 plus 37 it is 41. 12 by 2 it is 6. So 41 into 6. 6 ones are 6. 6 4 are 24. So 246 is the answer. So please observe for finding any unknown term a d n. Use this formula a n formula. To find sum of nth term, use this formula when a n is given. Only if you have a and d, just you can use 2a plus n minus 1 into d. If you do, if you use that formula also, it is you will get the same answer. 246. You can try it. Sub question four. This is very important. Observe carefully. So here given is a three equals 15. Yes, ten equals one twenty five. Find d and a ten. Find d and a ten. So let us take now a three equals fifteen. Clear. So a three can be written as a plus two d. A plus two d equals fifteen. So let me keep like this only. So observe a three can be written as a plus two d as I told you n minus one three minus one it is two. A plus two d equals fifteen. Yes, ten. Yes, ten equals one twenty five. Yes, ten equals one twenty five. So here, yes, ten. Let me substitute one twenty five. Ten by two. As you know, what is the n here? Ten. So ten by two. We are using this formula. This formula we are using. N by two. Two a plus n minus one into d. So here n is ten by two. N by two. It is ten by two. Two a plus. Here, what is n? Ten minus one into d. Because we are not given a value. So we are keeping a and d same. So ten minus one. So one twenty five as it is ten by two it is five two a ten minus one it is nine nine d. So if you take five to this side it became divide division. So one twenty five divided by five it is twenty five two a plus nine d. So now here I am taking this equation as two. Why I took this equation as two means we are converting this this as equation one. Observe. So here equation this is twenty five is equal to two a plus ninety. Take equation number two, and when you are subtracting as we did in previous exercises, equation two minus equation one. When you are subtracting, you have to observe that the terms are equal. Like if it is a here also it should be a. 
ये ये और 2d डी मीन्स टू डी लाइक दिस बट हियर द ए वैल्यू इज ये बट हियर टू ए सो हियर वी हैव टू मल्टीप्लाई बाई टू टू मेक इट एज टू ए टू इन टू इन टू ए टू ए टू इंटू टू डी फोर डी फिफ्टीन इंटू टू थर्टी लाइक दिस सो टू मेक इट अ कॉमन टर्म्स हियर टू ए टू ए बिकॉज वी हैव टू कैंसल द ए टर्म सो इन टू बाई डूइंग लाइक दिस द टर्म शुड बी इक्वल आइदर ए टर्म और आइदर डी टर्म क्लियर so now if you multiply the this equation by 2 what you will get 2 into a 2a 2 into 2d 4d 15 into 30 so we got one equation take it as equation 1 so equation 1 equation 2 so our same process equation 2 minus equation 1 so lhs to lhs rhs to rhs first let me take the equation 2 2a plus 9d minus of minus so minus 2a minus of minus 4d so minus 4d Here twenty five it is twenty five minus thirty clear so two a two a cancel so nine minus four d five d twenty five minus thirty it is minus five d equals minus five by five d equals minus one so we got the d value so now using this d value again we have to find the a so again you take this equation one two a plus four d equals thirty let me substitute d value in this two a plus four into minus one thirty Plus into minus minus four one zero four two a minus four is equal to thirty. So if we send minus four, it became plus four two a is equal to thirty four. So a equals thirty four by two. A equals seventeen. So we got d value. We got a value. Again directly they asked to find a ten. A ten equals a plus nine d. So a is seventeen. Nine into minus one. Nine into minus one is minus nine. Seventeen minus nine it is. Eight. So we got d value minus one, a value minus seventeen. A ten is eight. So here, when they give like this, using this, using this, first find out the two equations, and by solving two equation, we'll get d value. By substituting d value of any two equation, we'll get a value. Using this a value, find a ten. So last question in this. main heading that is question number 5 so observe the given d equal 5 s9 equal 75 find a and a9 so as you all know take the formula sn equals n by 2 2a plus n minus 1 into d here they gave s9 s9 means 9 by 2 2a as it is n minus 1 9 minus 1 d is given it is 5 So what is yes nine value seventy five substitute here nine by two two a plus nine minus one it is eight eight five is a forty so here seventy five seventy five it is given nine by two is given so observe here two a plus forty here I, if I take two common what happens a plus twenty clear so if you multiply two also two into a two a two a two into twenty forty so why I am taking because to cancel these two. Nine by two, it is not divisible. We'll get decimal. So when you are multiplying decimal, it it seems difficult. So here, if it is like multiples of two, take two common. So here two two cancelled. So remaining will be seventy five. Two two cancel here nine a plus twenty. So now multiply nine to the whole term. So nine into a nine a nine into twenty it is one eighty. So now take one eighty to the LHS seventy five minus one eighty. Is equal to nine a. So on a seventy five minus one eighty, we'll get hundred and five is equal to nine a. Hundred and five is equal to nine a. But hundred and five by nine, it is not completely divisible. So we are making it as simple. So if it is, so hundred and five by nine. So nine three is a nine. Sorry, three nine three three is a nine three. Thirty-five is a one not five, so minus thirty-five by three is the simplest form. What is the value of a? Minus thirty-five by three. So what they asked again? We got a value a nine. A nine can be written as a plus a d. If it is like nth term, directly you can use this. No need to write a plus n minus one into d. Directly you write a nine equals a plus a d. Let me substitute a and d value. So a is minus like this thirty-five by three. Again eight by Sorry, eighteen to five. So here minus thirty-five by three plus eighteen to five. Eight five is a forty. So now it is like this: minus thirty-five by three 
plus 40. So now how we will get doing LCM? So multiply this minus 35, 40 into 3 it is 120, 120 by 3. So minus 35 plus 120 you got 85. So observe 120, 85. So how much we will get? 11, so 10, so 35. So, 10, 5, 11 minus 3, 8. So, 85 by 3 is the value of A9. So, observe when you they give like this, using this, find the one, write the formula, substitute it, you will get the A value. Using A and D value given, A9 is A plus A D, substituting you will get the A9 value. So, today in question number 3, we did only 5 problems, remaining 5 problems we will do in next session.